what do we got this time? Nothing? An empty room? Wait, what's that? Holy crap, it's a huge ass scorpion! Thousand year arachnid mold arach. Yeah, so this boss is pretty easy actually. You wait for it to open his claws, hit his eye, hit his eye, and just rinse and repeat to destroy the arms. This is probably the easiest boss in the game. Yep. Just do that with both of these claws. Destroy them both. Watch out for his tail. Damn man, how much HP does this thing have? There you go. Now he's gonna open his actual eye, stab, and then it will go under. So then you have to use the blower to get him out. Just keep stabbing. Yeah, I think you can only stab him twice before he goes under again. There you go! He's down for the count. Pretty simple boss. I was actually quite surprised that they put an easy boss like this in the game. Yeah, we got a heart container for our troubles. Ow. I just spashed my head into the wall. Whoa, what's going on? Of course, with like with every other Zelda game where a boss has been in a room filled with sand, the sand disappears. There's the way out. The way to Zelda. Get a heart container! Ooh, that's a lot of hearts. This room actually looks quite cool. I gotta wonder what they used this room for back in the day. And now for one of the most epic rooms in the game. There's no music here at all, just quietness. With a time shift stone in the middle of the room. Yeah, this room is actually pretty cool. We'll see. Come yeah, on. I wish I had the upgraded beetle. <laughs> Look at that, man. It's awesome. It's even better that you have to get in the cart and just go straight across. Like, yeah, you all salute me. You all salute me. We're done with the third temple, guys. Done with the third temple. We're getting, we're getting far now. So let's go and see Zelda. Of course it's not that easy. Ah, <laughs> oh, this guy again. And of course he blocks us, us up. But 
an impulse with a badass. Your grace, quickly to the gate! Huh? You'll need this where you're going. You got the goddess heart, but now is not the time to give it a close examination. No shit! Oh, the fire is slowly disappearing. <laughs> Go! You have my thanks, I will leave them to you. Hey! You must go now, return to the old woman at the sealed grounds. Tell her what happened here, she'll know where, where you must go. Now, <laughs> I'll definitely see you again. This isn't goodbye. <laughs> Promise. Boom! <laughs> they blow up the gate. <laughs> now you've done it. Oh, he's mad. <laughs> I blame myself. I should have reprimanded you the last time we fought. I take pleasure in punishing you, but I have no time for recreation. Next time, I'll do more than just beat you senseless. Make the affair so excruciating, you'll deafen yourself with the shrill sound of your own screams. And now we lost Zelda once again. But at least this time we know where to go. Nope, not yet. Report, Master. Yeah. Zelda's no longer in this time. That was a time gate, and she traveled through time. So yeah, we have to travel to the sealed temple now, but it's not like a goddess cube around there somewhere. Or am I just thinking about some wrong stuff? There's some rupees around if you want to collect them. But I guess not. Oh, there's a Goron over here. Let's see what he's got to say. What? You made it inside? You mean to say there's a secret passage that I didn't know about? Why didn't you all tell me about it? I was just about to give up and go home, and I heard this huge crash. I rushed back here to find what the way has been cleared. I'm going to explore inside. I'll get back to sealed ground soon. Looks like I'm going to be busy. Yep, you are. You are, good sir. So, I'm going to head up to the sky. Now there's a bunch of stuff I can do. Including some goddess cubes I can collect. So let's have a look around, shall we? Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff we can do now. I'm just gonna head back to Skyloft, I think. Just call it the day there. Yes, we're up to like 55 minutes, that temple took a lot, a long time, a lot more than I thought. And I need to buy some food and stuff. So I don't starve to death. So... Take a swan dive, dive, dive. Let's take a swan dive. So yeah, well, I'm gonna cut it off here, thank you all so much for watching, and next time on Skyward Sword, uh, we're probably gonna, probably gonna do some side quests, so thank you all for watching, and goodbye.